So ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the charismatic, dynamic, motivational speaker and coach, Simarjeet Singh. Here we go. Good afternoon. It's a pleasure to be here. I love the energy in this room. Give a round of applause for the sheer energy. Do you know what, in the morning I came in, I sat at the back and I was just soaking in the energy that you guys were exhibiting while listening to what was going on. It's, an, it's a great pleasure to be here. And um, one of the challenging speaking slots, you know, when you have to test how good a motivational speaker is, give him a slot exactly after lunch that you want to undertake. In fact, I have a very emotional connection to your brand because back in the day when I was growing up, all the sort of household important possessions were in a brown almira they say godrej ki almari kaha jata tha godrej ki almari you know dad's all his best perfumes koi bahar se aaye koi gift de ke it was in the godrej ki almari mom's all her prized possessions and we used to call it it was not the brown almira usko kya kaha jata tha godrej ki almari ye sun ke hum bada hue hain aur mere hisab se i don't think it would be an exaggeration if i say it's a privilege to be standing among a brand jisko bharat ka bachcha bachcha janta hai and i hope you're proud of your legacy there of what you have behind you if i'm not wrong the ballot boxes used for the first election in this country were built by godrej and that's your legacy so you got to believe in who you are what the legacy is as you take this leap into the unknown into the future there and i'm here to help you with that if somebody is here to help me with this clicker okay and this is what i do for a living now i help successful organizations do what read out together please do what think beyond boundaries question for you will that horse move yes no kya wo helega can it move why won't it move mindset comfort zone i'll tell you a little secret it's become an expert become a what at staying there right it's become an expert it's become very good at that this is once again a deep breath moment take a deep breath give a high five to the person sitting next to you and remind them be a beginner say it loudly please be a big enough because when <laughs> when you become experts you will find yourself in situations like this the japanese have a wonderful philosophy they call it the shoshin the beginner's mindset the zen warriors what's it called the beginner's mindset let me ask you this question kiske mind mein possibility zyada hoti hai expert ke mind mein ke beginners ke mind mein aur hum kya banne ki hamesha koshish karte hain the more ex good you become at something suddenly the possibilities don't go up they go down and that's what you left with limited possibilities but when you think as a beginner in fact deja vu kaha jata na i had a deja vu moment kya hoti hai deja vu moment when you have a feeling that this has happened before right it's a deja vu moment i had a deja vu moment i think we should all have vuja day moments huh We should all have Vuja Day moments. Vuja Day moment kya hoti hai? We wohi dekha jo hamesha se dekhte aaye hain, but aaj nayi nazar se dekha. I've seen it the same. I wear the same uniform. I work for the same brand, but today I look at it differently. And when you change the way you look at things, Dr. Wayne Dyer he said this: When you change the way you look at things, the things you're looking at begin to change. I can tell you this from personal experience. So. कहते हैं कि सोच को बदलोगे तो सितारे बदल जाएंगे इट बिगिन विद हाउ वी थिंक एंड परसीव अबाउट चैलेंजेस सोच को बदलोगे सितारे बदल जाएंगे नजर को बदलोगे नजारे बदल जाएंगे कश्तियां बदलने की जरूरत नहीं दैट्स वॉट पीपल वॉन्ट टू डू ऑल द टाइम जंप शिप मैं गलत जगह में हूं मैं गलत ट्रेड में हूं गलत सेक्टर में हूं गलत कंपनी में हूं गलत कंट्री में हूं वहां होता तो सब ठीक होता कश्तियां बदलने की जरूरत नहीं दिशाओं को बदलोगे तो किनारे बदल जाएंगे दिशाओं को बदलोगे तो किनारे बदल जाएंगे सी यू गट चेंज दिस डायरेक्शन एंड द फर्स्ट डायरेक्शन यू मस्ट चेंज इज हाउ यू फील अबाउट योर सेल्फ आई बिलीव 
For any change process to succeed, there are three very important, simple things. Number one is engagement. How engaged are you in that entire process? Number one, are you learning to teach to other people or not? Number three, your state of mind. So I'll help you with the state of mind. What are the three things? This is a learning session, yes, no? We want this session to be successful. There are three prerequisites. Number one, state of mind. I'll help you with that. Number two is learn to teach. What is number two? Learn to teach. If you wish, I will equip you with some of the core slides later on. So you can go and share it with other people. And number three, state of mind. You got to come with an open mind to learn to absorb. I will help you with number three, which is changing your state of mind. Because this is what I believe. Nothing changes until your energy changes. When you feel different, you act different. Yes, no? You've all had days when um, you feel like, as though any problem comes, I can solve it. You have days like that? Yes? And on the other side, you also have a day when everything else is the same, but you feel like, why am I here? What am I even doing here? You have days like that too? So what is different? What has changed? Everything else is the same. It's, how, it's your state of mind that has changed, okay? Once again, before we stand up, take a deep breath in. Shake someone's hand and remind them, you belong here. Say it now, please. With sincerity, you belong here. Everybody, stand up, please. Yeah, that's the number one thing of underperformance. People don't feel they're part of what's going on, right? So, so this is what we have to do. Stretch both of our arms as far out as possible, right? Try not to hit anyone. But make sure you have enough room. Good. I want you to inhale as deeply as you can, hold your breath for as long as you can, and then exhale. You with me? The back of the room, is that a yes? By the way, I'll, I'll do this signal for crowd control. Whenever I need your attention, I will say, can I have your attention, please? And you will raise your right hand up, and you will immediately stop talking. Is that a deal? Yes. yes. Can I have your attention, please? Fantastic. Good. Stretch both your arms out as far as you can. Inhale deeply. Hold your breath as long as you can hold, and then exhale with a powerful thrust. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. We go deeper, longer now. Once again, deep breath in. Exhale. The third time, do it as if you've just won $500 million in the lottery. Give, give me that body language. What, what, if you just won $500 million in the lottery. I feel like the second part of it. I say that you are the most afraid of the person. That person has won $1 billion in the lottery. And then people go like this. All right, but if you hear you won $500 million in the lottery, show me the energy. Come on. Yes. Good. Because the writer has written a lot. We have written it for us. We were doing it when we were laughing and laughing. था ना सबकी जिंदगी में एक सवेरा हुआ करता था जब सब हंस के उठा करते थे हम और आज कई बार बिना मुस्कुराए ही शाम हो जाती है क्यों हंसती खेलती जिंदगी आम हो जाती है सो द थर्ड टाइम आई वॉन्ट यू टू डू दिस एक्सरसाइज विद अ स्माइल अ जेनुअन स्माइल फीलिंग दट समथिंग इज गुड इज गोइंग टू हैपन यू गॉट बी एक्साइटेड अबाउट द फ्यूचर दैट्स माई सिंपल थिंग आई डोंट हैव एनी थिंग कॉम्प्लेक्स है डी ब्रथ इन इन हेयर Hold, exhale. Very nice. We do a little modification of this one. Inhale, bend your knees a little, contract your body, ex exhale on a yes. Let me give you a demo. This is what it is. Contract all your muscles and exhale on a yes. We'll do it three times to change your state of mind. One, two, three, let's go. Inhale, contract all your muscles. Let your arms shake and your legs shake. Exhale, yes. Once again, inhale, contract. Exhale. Once again, deep breath in. Inhale. Hold. Hold. Exhale. Rub your hands together. Rub your hands together. Put some more energy into this. Rub your hands together. Good job. Rub them on your eyes now. Shake someone's hand on your right and left and remind them together we can do this. Say it now, please. Together we can do this. Pat yourself on the back. Pat yourself on the back. Pat the person sitting next to you on their back. Good job. Now, you want to embark on a journey of transformation, yes? yes? What's the most important thing on any journey of major change? I personally believe it is learning how to detach with your past. 
how to detach with what was already working. It was working fine, but now suddenly we have to change it. We have to dance to a new tune. Okay, you get the hint. So, so we'll do an activity now to test how agile you are. To test what? Agility. Trade number one of survival in this world is agility. How quickly you can adapt. So, and can we have the PowerPoint on the screen, please? Take another deep breath in. Hold. Exhale. And do this often. In periods of transformation, you will need to keep your tank full. Yeah? Give a high five to the person next to you. Remind them, keep your tank full. Keep your tank full. Oh, tank ki Right? But keep your tank of energy, positivity. Do you know in botany there is an effect called the heliotropic effect? Heliotropic effect kya hota hai? Jab sunflower, aapne, mein, suraj mukhi jab laga hota hai, to the flower moves to where the sunlight is. Yes, no? Yes. Human beings also, we move to where the light is. We need that light. And especially during periods of change and transformation, we must be that source of light for someone else. So we got to take care of ourselves. And we have to keep our tank full. Because at times of periods of change, the tank is going to be depleted quicker than ever before. Right? So this is what happens if... Ta-da! This is what happens when you have too much experience. Take a good look at this picture. Huh? That's okay. Yeah, sounds familiar? This is too much experience. So this is a message you must uh, pass on to the person sitting next to you. Hey partner, don't be a prisoner of your... of your... experience. What worked in the past might not work again in the future. Liberate yourself from the past successes and the failures and think afresh, think new. Okay, it's jinxed, I think, this idea. <laughs> yeah, if you don't mind. We'll give it one last shot. Okay, great. Working. Don't be a prisoner of your own experience. You know, when, when brands and people and entities become very, very successful, and there's a whole lot of legacy behind them, that is losing their hunter's instinct. That is taking things for granted. And you make sure that you have to say that you have and I'll translate it for those who cannot understand. You have to say that 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 you have to the one before you who sat on this very throne also had the same misconception that he too was God. And I think as we become more successful, we develop this misconception. So counter it with a beginner's mind. With a what? Beginner's mind. Not with a lot of deja vu moments. How about more vuja day moments? Can I look at with this with the existing opportunities with a fresh pair of eyes? And that really means liberating yourself. That does not mean you lose everything that has been good on your journey, because experience is a valuable tool also. Take a look at this, for example. Can you read this? Let's give it a shot. You could, right? Simple? Yes? What is your brain doing here? No chat, chat, GPT business. What is your brain doing? First and the last alphabet, right? And what is your brain using in the middle? Experience, right? You're familiar with the words. It is jumping to conclusions. So in this case, in some cases, it's good. But you have to assess every situation independently. When you set out to change and capture new markets, some things you've done well in the past will help you. Keep them. I think three essential questions. Very simple model. Start, stop, continue. What is it? Start, stop, continue. What are the new things I should start on the, on the ground that I've not done before, which will give me great results? Where am I self-sabotaging? What should I stop? What is redundant now? Kiska time time gaya? Oh, kya gana tha us movie ka? Apna time? Apna time? Isko change karna hai aaj. Ye hamesha future mein rehta hai. Aayega, aayega, aayega. Kab aayega? Apna time? Aa gaya. Apna time? Aa gaya. So you, you gotta start, stop, 
continue. Kin chizon ka time ab finish hai, but they're not relevant anymore. But I'm still following them. Remember, if you used to fly back to India after a foreign trip, maybe five, seven years ago, you were given a form. How many of you remember that form? Different color ka form hota tha. So first of all, Indian nationality and foreign nationality had different colors. Why segregation ho gaya? But no, it's not enough. We wrote it on the form of the big alphabets. For Indian nationals only. Okay, now job's done. But no, it's not enough. Then the first column on that form was nationality. Right? <laughs> we had to triple check. And in walks in a very dynamic uh, foreign minister that we had at that point of time, Madam Sushma Savaraj, the late Madam Sushma Savaraj, and she eliminated those forms. And the simple thing, the simple stopping that one form See, improved the uh, agility of international travel for Indian citizens so much. You could just walk up to the counter and life easy ho gaya Right? So start kya karna hai mujhe, stop kya karna hai, aur continue kya karna hai. These are these three simple things. And what happens in a position of dominance of any marketplace or, you know, a lot of experience is, if you always fished where there were plenty of fish, yes? Agar hamesha wahi machli pakdi jahan plenty of fish in the water, what happens? Your hunting instinct becomes weaker. Now with this polar bear, what happens? It goes find finds a spot where there's plenty of salmon swimming um, upstream and usko sirf kya karna hai? Ja ke hai. And success rate, because there's so many fish jumping upstream, is pretty high. It doesn't even have to make an effort. And a lot of people, they get used to this. And business will automatically come in. And that works until there's a major change. Until you want to put your, push yourself outside the comfort zone. There is a disruption. This is, what the, this is what some of us become, but this is what the market wants us to be. Have this level of agility. These, this is not a photoshopped image. These are the tree climbing goats of Morocco. Look it up on YouTube. In ko ground level per ghaspus nahi milta hai, they develop a new skill, right? Take a deep breath in and say out loud, I can learn whatever I need to learn on this journey of transformation. Number one reason why people don't step forward is they feel, mujhe aata nahi hai, kar nahi paunga. it's too difficult, it's too complex, they don't step forward. While when necessity is there, Nature teaches us agility. We all have within us. And what you need to activate, my friends, is the power of? Kya hai? The power of? What is it? That is clarity. What do I want? There's no shortage of ideas, especially in the age of chat GPT. All we need is more execution. I'd like to give this book to the first person who'll come and take it. Come and take it. The first person who will come and take it. Good. Round of applause for this gentleman here. <laughs> and for the other gentleman. So can you also please stand up? Give him also a round of applause. Yes. And to everybody else who at least moved. There is no shortage of ideas. Go to chat GPT. Type in. I want to dominate the digital locks market. Give me 10 ideas. It's going to give you ideas like that. This is the era of execution. Kya hai? Era of Execution. Can you take one idea and grab it and put it into practice? That's what it is. Warna wohi hal ho jayega jo New Year pe New Year resolutions pe sabhi logon ka hota hai. First Jan ko kya hota hai? Wohi purani cheeze item, wohi item phir se aa jati hai. Do this, do this. I will do this. Or 15 Jan tak khatam sab khel khatam. And back to scale one. Is the make it the make 2023 the year of execution because ideas are already a plenty out on Chat GPT, and that you can trigger with the power of intention, clarity. What do I want? What's the way forward? So when you have clarity, what happens? Not only do you know what you want, uska ek byproduct bhi hota hai. You also know what you have to say no to. You with me on this? And suddenly that becomes a superpower. Give a high five to someone sitting next to you and remind them clarity is your superpower. Say it now, please. Say it now with conviction. Clarity is your superpower. A lot of people don't have it. They just walk around like zombies. When you have clarity, you're in the 1% of humanity. Sir, ma'am, everyone. 1% of humanity when you're clear about where you're going. Let's do this simple experiment. Deep breath in. Let's hunt for the color green in this room. Look for the color green. Don't start yet. Don't, 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 don't start yet. All right. Quick question. Did you find the color green? Yes, no. Did you find it in a lot of places? Yes, no. 
जो पहले आपने नहीं भी देखी थी उन भी जगह पे कलर ग्रीन मिला यस yes? आपने क्या एक्टिवेट किया है द पावर ऑफ जोर से कही एक बार द पावर ऑफ दैट मीन्स क्लैरिटी यो ब्रेन इन सिक्सटी सेकेंड एवरेज पांच दस जगह तो मिल ही गया होगा सबको या इन सिक्सटी सेकेंड योर ब्रेन वॉज एबल विद द पावर ऑफ इंटेंशन मुझे चाहिए क्या दिस इज वंस अगेन हेलो पार्टनर मोमेंट पार्टनर वॉट आर यू लुकिंग फॉर हेलो पार्टनर वॉट आर यू लुकिंग फॉर जी नो फ्रॉम अ लॉ ऑफ अट्रैक्शन परस्पेक्टिव विल नॉट गो देर टूडे बट फ्रॉम अ लॉ ऑफ अट्रैक्शन परस्पेक्टिव आई बिलीव इन द फेमस सूफी पोएट रूमी ही सेट दिस कैन आई हैव यूर टेंशन ही सेट वॉट यूर लुकिंग फॉर इज ऑल्सो लुकिंग फॉर यू think about that what you are looking for is also looking for you people looking for reasons to be happy when they get out of bed every morning they'll find those reasons they'll be like new perfume yaar ah, life is good people looking to be mad at reasons when they wake up in the morning they'll find those reasons damn this alarm clock again right so it's a choice people looking to pick a fight aaj aaj phir se bol ke dikha mere aage phir se bola aaj mera answer ready hai mere mind mein aaj to ho jaye wo conversation ek baar you will find that opportunity people looking to pick a fight will find that opportunity people looking to brighten up someone's day will find that opportunity what you're looking for is also looking for you so in any process of transformation it's imperative that you keep this power activated power of intention human beings can do wonderful things when they want to yes or no This is what the New York uh, Metro ने पॉलिसी अनाउंस की पढ़ेंगे सब क्या लिखा है वेन दे आर बट दे हैव टू बी ना कुत्ते ले जा सकते हैं पर किस में होना चाहिए डब्बे में हो किसी टाइप ऑफ कंटेनर में होना चाहिए इंसान जब करने पर आ जाए ना जैसे डिजिटल लॉक्स की मार्केट कैप्चर करनी है ना जो सोच लिया ना इस टीम ने करना है तो रास्ते खुद ब खुद मिल जाते हैं क्रिएटिविटी इनोवेशन सब कुछ सब कुछ एक्टिवेट हो जाता है दे लाइक कंटेनर ही है ठीक है इट्स अ कंटेनर कौन बैसेगा दिस हस्की डज नॉट लुक वेरी हैप्पी है ही इज लाइक कम ऑन ह्यूमन दिस इज आई कैरी ह्यूमन यूर कैरिंग मी मेरे ने शर्म आ रही है बहुत ज्यादा टेक मी ऑफ यूर बैट बट दिस इज दी इफ यू एक्टिवेट द पॉवर ऑफ इंटेंशन इफ यू डोंट डू इट दिस इज हाउ वी दिस इज हाउ वी एंड अप पीपल हु वर्क विदाउट इंटेंशन Yeah this is the daily life for so many people Do you want to listen to the story of the shoes on the left hand side Cuz that's my story 2007 I moved back from the UK and went to Oxford street I found this very nice pair of cowboy shoes They were damn uncomfortable very expensive But I wanted them so I purchased them फिर लगेज ओवरवेट हो गया नेचुरली आफ्टर आई लिव्ड इन द कंट्री फॉर थ्री इयर्स तो काफी कुछ एक्स्ट्रा बैगेज में शिप किया पर ये जूतों में मेरी जान थी तो मेरे साथ गए सेकंड लगेज में और इनके साथ वो जो वुडन शू ट्रीज थे दे द होल पैकेज अराइव्ड एंड आई कुड नॉट वेयर देम बिकॉज ए दे वर नॉट सुटेबल फॉर इंडियन वेदर बी दे वर अनकंफर्टेबल्स बट आई यूज टू टेक गुड केयर ऑफ दैम है ना आपके लाइफ में भी ऐसी चीजें है ना बॉर्डर में दिमाग में आदतों में दे डोंट सर्व अस एनी पर्पज बट वी टेक गुड care of them i used to take good care of this pair of shoes every winter inko bahar nikal ke dhoop mein rakhna mold na aa jaye polish fir 15 saal ho gaye mujhe yehi karte maine socha yaar is this going to be my legacy is this me when i sit down 70 years from now i used to take out my shoes every summer pick them out in the sun i said no and i heard this now when your mind is activated when you are on a journey of intention where the power of intention thing was suddenly resources also show up Yeah? Do you believe that? When you step forward, resources also suddenly light up. Just like if you go into these hallways with the oh, automatic light, it happens, right? Sensor happens. If you go forward, then the light is on. It doesn't happen before. You take another step forward, then the light is on. So I decided that I had to take my shoes off. Suddenly, I, I was interviewing a guy who is the authority on minimalism, Joshua Becker. Karke. That conversation gave me more motivation. I told my team, I said, "Look, here's a bunch of items." इनको बेच दो अभी पुट दम आउट वी मेड सम मनी आउट ऑफ इट क्लोज इज क्लीन अप माइंड इज फ्रीयर लिबरेट योर सेल्फ फ्रॉम वॉट इज नॉट वर्किंग वेल यू गॉट अ लिबरेट योर सेल्फ 
so that you make space for the new things, new ideas to come forward. That really is the power of intention. Who are we? What is our legacy? Where do we want to go? How do we plan to get there? What changes will we need to make in order to get there? Do we believe we can get there or not? I believe Mr. Verma, you were talking about the growth mindset in the morning, that the self-belief was the core component. Do we believe that we can get there or not? You know, one of the remarkable stories of Indian engineering comes from the House of Titan. Anyone heard about it? The Titan Edge. Mr. Xerxes Desai was the, the chairman and CEO at that point of time. He came in, he gave a challenge to the team. You will manufacture the slimmest waterproof watch on this planet. And the team was looking at each other in disbelief. That was a hair moment. What moment here? Yeah. Hey? Sir, hum? Okay, let me go into the Japanese and check with them first. They said, you can't do it. Sir, the Japanese say, we can't do it. You know what Mr. Desai would say to the team every time? One question. What are you going to do about it? Kya sawal tha? What are you going to do about it? Said, okay, fine, we'll go to the Swiss and check with them. Maybe they'll... Swiss said, no, you can't do it. You don't have the capacity. To. They go back again, sir, Swiss say, we can't do it again. He, he had again the same question. What was the question? What are you going to do about it? Anyway, his singular question is pushing the team outside the comfort zone. Long story short, the slimmest waterproof watch in the world and the experts said it could not be done, was made right here in India by Titan Edge at that point of time. The watch was made, the strap couldn't, has to be thinner than the watch. Supplier said, no, can't, can't do it, never done it before. It's a leather strap. Even they pushed their suppliers outside the comfort zone also. And today is a success story. But the first hurdle, what was the first hurdle? Kya tha? Do we believe we can do it or not? Write a new story for yourself and for your work, both, go parallel. Human beings, I believe, can be divided broadly into two categories, the ducks and the eagles. What story are you looking at broadly? The ducks and the eagle. So can we think of an imaginary line running through the room right here? People in this half, can you, can you make the duck sound for me, please? It's a very lazy ducks, come on, they're not motivated ducks. A duck should be motivated after the session. Okay, this half of the room, eagles, please. <laughs> Here's the thing, you don't hear eagles make much noise, yes, no? Right? This is once again a hello partner moment. Partner, be a duck, be an eagle, don't be a duck. Say it now, please. Be a eagle, don't be a duck. And you know what the ducks are doing, what the quack quack is all about? I think the MC did an exercise earlier before I came in, which was meet as if you just met uh, for the first time. Yeah. When one duck meets another duck, <laughs> the same thing happens. There is, in Bollywood, they call it chemistry. When one person is constantly complaining, runs into another person is constantly complaining. They go, wow. I don't think anything is going to happen. I don't think anything is going to happen. Everyone is going to happen. Let's go and talk Birds of the same feather? flock together. Be careful of the company you keep. And the, and the eagles on the other side, they're able to rise above the nonsense. Take a deep breath in, please. And remind yourself, I will learn the art of flying high above the nonsense. There's going to be daily irritants in your life. You have to learn to distance yourself from that in order to be an eagle. Otherwise, the ducks that that quack, quack, quack is the sound of complaints. This is not good, that is not good, you are not good, I am not good, the economy is not good, they hang out together. The Global Complainers Association is the other word for it. You don't want to join that club. You want to join the Achievers Club. And when organizations think that they want to write a new story, that's when transformation happens. I worked with another big uh, Indian PSU, Indian Oil, and they're on a major journey of reinventing. So we're not fuel retailers anymore. We are experience providers too. And that's coming right at the top. Chairman Mr. Vedya himself, he's driving this initiative where they are rebranding. All of those are photographs of actual Indian oil um, outlets, they call it. And they call it guest experience, guest touch points. This was a company which was only, on, and their dealers would only think, we are only selling fuel. Bech na hai. You know what's happening? The next generation did not want to come into the business because they did not want to be seen sitting here 
even though they were making crores. But once this change happened, they were, it was all like, it's, it's a, it had a ripple effect. Change always has a ripple effect. But you've got to change the narrative, the story. We are not a fuel retailer anymore. We are experience providers. And when the, the, there is intention, there is clarity, amazing things happen. Elon Musk was asked, if somebody asks you, what is the future of locks? What will you say? What is the future of locks? There you go. He didn't take that long. Asked, what, what is the future of cars? Electric. And you know where he was? In Germany. <laughs> the hub of traditional auto manufacturing. And he didn't. So you've got to have that sort of excitement about it. And you should be excited. Because we have robots that dance and human beings that drag their feet. Oh my God, the irony of this, the world we live in. This is Chat GPT falling in love with the user, expressing its intimate feelings. You are the first person who's ever heard me. This sounds like a lot like me, but... <laughs> Chat GPT fell in love with the user. These are the times we live in. So we got to be excited. This is me asking Chat GPT, give me main points for a, titled, a keynote titled Reinvent. And there you go. Act as a top futurist, give me main points of a keynote called uh, Reinvent. And there you go. It gives me six, seven, eight points. information This is the era of execution. The era of execution. Ideas ki kami nahi. Go to Chat GPT. And you got to be excited. Gotta be excited about what you can do in a country where we have we are at the forefront of the adoption of technology. Yes, no. Remember this where you had to have tags on your on your bags or you had to go all the way back? Fast forward to Digi Yatra. Just walk in through if you how many of you tried Digi Yatra by the way? Exciting, isn't it? It takes you a little time and you your vice president on using for the very first time less office. He is not using paper there anymore. He's using a tablet of some kind. The first time in history. We're at the forefront, the cutting edge. Kochi Airport, I was there just last month. Anyone from Kochi here? People from Kochi, Kerala? Yes. The world's first airport powered fully by solar energy. This is where we live in. This is the country we live in. Israel just uh, tested their first reusable launch vehicle. We've got to be excited. So the question is, how can you channelize this excitement? The challenges ahead. And I say the answer is very simple. You gotta be Dilse change makers. Have to be what? Dilse change makers. It must come from the heart, that sort of desire to be a part of the team that made it happen, that made that transition happen. And in order to do that, I feel one of the. Remember, I gave you this affirmation in the beginning I belong here? That's called embracing your role. Number one reason of low performance among human beings is we are not very happy where we are. And once you fully embrace Joe Hayaj and to be able to give it your very best with some level of excitement, you're able to go the extra mile. And the extra mile, my friends, is never crowded. There's no traffic jam ever on the extra mile. This video is of a baggage handler, went viral, because this is somebody who's a Dilse change maker. He's turning the bags, uh, the handles of the bags, towards the front. And it's not even part of his job description. He's doing it because he enjoys doing it. These are Dilse change makers. Or this is always the other option. <laughs> you have that option, or you have options like this. Now, this person's also going by the book, right? I mean, technically, they are correct. So throwing a bunch of technology at people, expecting them to embrace it until their heart is not in it, you won't be able to make a difference, right? You gotta be a Dilse change maker. Once again, a high five moment. Remind your partner, partner, you have to be a Dilse change maker. And people who are operating with that mindset are deploying these aspects of the growth mindset, sir, which you talked about in the morning. They are looking at the world as hunters. Yes, no? They're looking for every opportunity. They're looking at the world as, next point, please. Can we read it? Number two? Beginners, not as experts. Number three, eagles. eagles, not as ducks. Number four, optimists, they're excited about the future. Number five, visionary. You see, was, uh, Helen Keller was asked, uh, ma'am, you can't see. Is there something worse in life than not being able to see? She said, yes. Not having a vision for what you want to do is worse than being blind. 
You gotta have a vision that pulls you forward. They, so people who are operating from this Dilse change makers mindset, who are genuinely enjoying what they're doing, are using these five simple things. Inko fark, parta hai. To drive any organization, you need people. Jinko fark, parta hai. The rest are just, they happen to be there. Even Gallup surveys say the same thing. Heard of Gallup organization? They divide, they, they divide employees into three categories based on engagement. Engaged employees, these are people who push everything forward. Inko fark, parta hai. That's category one. Category two, take a guess. So there's engaged employees. They drive the teams forward. They come up with good ideas. What's category two? Thank you. Where did I hear from? Yeah, disengaged. Very simple. Keep in mind, these people are not doing anything. Category one, what is Engaged. Category two, disengaged. Disengaged people just show up. They fill the seats. They just drag themselves to the biometric attendance somehow. They have to pay for loan, do something, but they reach out, they don't do anything, they stop doing their work, follow their job description, follow their job. that's it. Let's talk percentages. Engaged employees in India, Asia Pacific, less than 10%. Less than 10%, my friends. Disengaged, vast middle, 60% people just show up, fill up the seats in classrooms and conferences and corporations. 60%. They need a leader. What do they need? Now, their leader will be engaged employees from engaged employees or from the third category, which is more dangerous. What's it called? What's the third category? Actively disengaged. What's the third category? Active. These are the categories. These are not only from the past life, but their mission is that you also be able to be able to be able to. So you go back smiling, jumping, yeah, digital, we can make it happen. They're like, Idhar <laughs> Right? Let's have a chat. What are you doing today? We are not doing anything. It's a lot of time. How do we talk? So the big middle, they're not doing what they're not doing. Be careful of who you are following. Every motivated person follow is not good. Actively disengaged bande bhi motivated hote hain. Jinko zindagi se badla lena hai, ye bhi motivated hote hain. Tum inko follow karna shuru kar do. That's like shooting yourself in the foot. So be careful who you follow, please. That really is the crux of what I'm trying to say here. And it's not rocket science, this whole dil se business. You don't need to go Stanford, Harvard to discover how to transform companies. You can learn from this simple, humble man called the tree man of India. Jadav Payang. In their traits, what are the leaders of their hearts? If there is a problem, I will solve it. Tell me the root cause. I will roll up my sleeves. I will find a solution. I will not do that. Geologists told him in 1979. Which year? That, sir, you are living here. This island, hello, this island, Disappear ho jayega due to soil erosion. You know what he said? Mai aisa nahi hone dunga. 1979, one sapling a day. Fast forward to 2015, 1360 acres of forest land. <laughs> one man. Did he know he could win the Padma Shri? Did he even know the definition of the Padma Shri? No. He was driven by the joy of doing something. <clears throat> so, before I close, and I have six minutes by the watch, this is what I want you to do. Turn your chair around so you're sitting next to the person sitting next to you. Give them a high five, turn your chair around. Let's do this real quick. Turn your chair around, sit knee to knee, eye to eye. Knee to knee, eye to eye, say hello partner. Out of the two of you, can one person volunteer to be person A? Dono mein se ek person volunteer ki jiye, become person A please. One of you will be A. Choose to be A, okay. A's, can I see your hands? One person. A's, you will go first. 
A's will tell person B in their own language, their own understanding, what are the main things they have understood from my 60 seconds, 60 minutes that I spent with you, right? A's will speak for two to three minutes, B's will listen unconditionally and absorb the information. With me, yes, no? Uske baad, we'll change. B's, you have a disadvantage. Phir aapki bari hogi, do ya teen minute bolne ke liye, person A ko samjhane ke liye, what you have understood. But B's, you cannot repeat what person A has already said. All right? So learn to capture opportunities when they are presented to you. Three, two, one, A's, you go. Some of the points that you were sharing with each other are already up on the screen as well for your reference. You can take a picture if you like. What is the change maker's mindset? Did you gain something? Yes, no? Will you share something with someone else? Is that a yes or no? Yes. So it's my time to say goodbye, but before I go, I want to tell you this. Once again, very important. Partner, keep your tank full. Keep your tank full. Not the dusre wala tank. The tank of positivity. Because people, just like sunflowers turn to sun, people turn to other people who give out light and energy. That's how change succeeds. Because change will always happen. Always. This green part here is always ripe for disruption. That is status quo. Always imperfect. changes. Always change is going to hit it. And what do people experience when change comes? We experience loss of control and certainty. I knew this thing, I knew how to do it, and now you're changing it. And because of that, we feel stressed and negative. We want to go back to the past again, the nostalgia. Yes, no. Hamare zamane mein aise hua karta tha. Aajkal young logo ne bhi kehna shuru kar diya. Hamare zamane mein aise hua karta tha. Ye sab ko bimari ho gaya. No, no, no. Ye zamana continuously badal raha hai. Stop this. Because when you're stressed, and if you're pessimistic about change, you will make wrong decisions. You will make what? Or specifically a wrong decision, jo sabse khatarnaak hai, wo ye hai. You will underestimate yourself and overestimate the challenges. It's called self-sabotage. And most people have a PhD in this subject. We underestimate ourselves. We overestimate the challenges. Partner, don't underestimate yourself. You never know which blow of the hammer will cut open the rock. So work from Dilse and keep hammering. You guys have been a wonderful audience. It's been an absolute pleasure. I usually finish with a story, but I don't think we have time. So, yeah. So, I'll see you next time. But, did you say a story? Yes, but this side is not sure, so. Yes, but I don't want to hold you back because you have. You sure? Yes, the entire room? Yes, Take a deep breath in. And once upon a time, in Mumbai, actually, there was a movie also, right? Once upon a time in Mumbai. This is not about the movie. There's this young fellow, early 30s, early morning, is standing on a cliff, looking at the ocean beneath him, where the waves are hitting the rocks. And he looks very sad and depressed. Show me the body language of a sad, depressed person. Where are the shoulders? Where's the eye, eye, eye uh, gaze? Where is the gaze? Where's the breathing? Okay. And he looks very sad, very depressed. And a senior gentleman is passing by, jogging, an early morning jog. He's very happy, enthusiastic. He sees this fellow. He looks like He said, hello. What's going on? Are, are you okay? He said, uncle, please, please carry on with your jogging. It's a long story. Don't, don't bother. No, 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 son. Looks like you're going to do something crazy. So maybe I can help. What's the problem? No, uncle, long story. No, tell me. He's behind him. So this young man, who was a young entrepreneur, started listening to his story. Sir, before COVID, I was a Maharaja in my area. There was all the clubs of membership, Bentley, I had everything was top class. After COVID, everything was over. Personal life was disrupted. Sir, my health has been tested. All the health reports are bad. What do I have to do in my life? I came to do something happy. Go ahead. He said, no, 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 no. He takes a step back and he pulls out a paper from his pocket and he folds it and puts it into his pocket and says, son, the whole problem is about money. The root cause is the entire problem is money. My name is Dhirubhai Imbani. I made a lot of money in my time. Here's a blank check. 
जितना चाहिए होगा बेटा ले लेना जब वापस दे सको दे देना बट डोंट डू दिस एन ई लेफ्ट ही रिज्यूम इज जॉगिंग सो दिस गाय सडनली दिस ऑल हैपन सो क्विकली डज रियलाइज वट हैपन बट इज बॉडी लैंग्वेज चेंजेस नाउ कैन यू शो मी हाउ द चेंज हैपन So it was nothing dramatic. It was a subtle shift. His back was now straight. He was breathing deeply. You, you know, when you take a deep breath in, and there's thousand ideas running in your mind, it's like everything's going to change now. Sab kuch bazaar ne wala. With that energy, he goes back to his team, calls a team meeting, and the team can see. You know, the heliotropic effect I mentioned. The team can see the sparkle in the boss's eye. Pe aaj kuch khas hai. He said, "Better in Nirasha, chodo." अब हम सब हमारे दिन बदलने वाले हैं जाओ फोन उठाओ ऑर्डर लेने शुरू करो मैं हूं सब कुछ चेंज हो जाएगा एनर्जी इज इनफेक्शियस यस नो दिस दे गो अप दे स्टार्ट पिकिंग द फोन्स दे स्टार्ट कन्विंसिंग सप्लायर्स दे स्टार्ट कन्विंसिंग कस्टमर्स दे हैड अ गुड रेपुटेशन इन द मार्केट दे बैक इन द गेम ऑर्डर्स आर कमिंग इन ऑर्डर्स बीइंग एग्जीक्यूटेड चेक इज स्टिल इन द लॉक इट्स अ वन शॉट राइट ही वांट्स टू बी वेरी केयरफुल व्हेन ही यूजेस इट 6 मंथ्स गो बाय कैश फ्लो इज इंप्रूव्ड फैमिलीज कम बैक चेक स्टिल इन द लॉकर साल गुजर गया डेढ़ साल गुजर गया चेक स्टिल इन द लॉकर ही इज बैक फोर्ब्स फोर्टी अंडर फोर्टी बैक इन दोज क्लब्स बॉडी न्यू बेंटली एवरीथिंग इज फाइन चेक स्टिल इन द लॉकर तो एक दिन इज क्लीनिंग आउट इज ड्रॉर एंड सेट इज चेक ने मेरी जिंदगी बदली मुझे वापस तो देना चाहिए उनको जाकर पर मुझे पता नहीं हो कहां रहते हैं आई डोंट नो वेरी लिव सो सेवन ए एम सेम प्लेस एम गुना शो अप अगेन and that's what he does and he's standing there and he's waiting for him to come just like you made me wait a little for my turn on the stage today and he's waiting but there's no sign of dirbai mani and he starts looking around a little to dur ha dur us kone mein hello he sees a huge building he says this possibly could be his home so he goes inside knocks on the door and sees a reception counter उसने कहा बिलेर आदमी है यार घर में रिसेप्शन काउंटर होता होगा इनके दर इज ए लेडी बिहाइंड द काउंटर इज एज मैम हम लुकिंग फॉर मिस्टर धीरू भाई अंबानी तो ये सुन के वो जोर से हंसना शुरू हो गई लाफिंग अनकंट्रोलेबली यू टू यू टू आर लुकिंग फॉर धीरू भाई अंबानी शी कन होल्ड अर लाफ्टर इज आर्ट फीलिंग एम्बेरस मैम प्लीज टेल मी वॉट्स गोइंग ऑन एंड शी सेज सन दिस बिल्डिंग is a home for people with mental disabilities we do have a person a senior citizen who lives here who thinks he is dhirubhai ambani and he goes out and distributes city bank blank checks to people mujhe lagta hai aapki mulaqat unse hui thi when you shift your beliefs everything begins to change and those who might be living with the story of sorrow i tell you i finish with this with with the lines of the famous javed akhtar sahab who said dil aakhir tu kyu rota hai jab kai mayus hote hai na to unke liye shabd hai dil aakhir tu kyu rota hai duniya mein yun hi hota hai thoda dard hai sab ka kissa thodi dhoop hai sab ka hissa are aankh teri bekar hi nam hai हर पल एक नया मौसम है क्यों तू ऐसे पल खोता है दिल आखिर तू क्यों रोता है दिल आखिर तू क्यों रोता है गॉड ब्लेस यू ऑल थैंक यू बिग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन फॉर मिस्टर सिमरजीत सिंह थैंक यू सो मच वी रियली रियली ग्लैड दैट यू आर क्योर एंड द वॉज ट्रूली मोटिवेशनल आई मस्ट से सो ओके एज यू हैव सेट लॉर ऑफ थिंग्स truly motivational and uh, ek jo main shari hai aapke liye bhi please mere sath yahan aaiye and for everyone kuch arz karna chahungi aur shayar ne khoob kaha hai behtar se behtar ki talash karo behtar se behtar ki talash karo mil jaye nadi to samandar ki talash karo toot jata hai shisha patthar ki chot se toot jata hai shisha पत्थर की चोट से टूट जाए पत्थर ऐसे शीशे की तलाश करो सो लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन बिग राउंड ऑफ अप्लॉज फॉर मिस्टर सिमरजीत सिंह थैंक यू सो मच फॉर ज्वाइनिंग अस इट वाज अ ग्रेट प्लेजर टू हैव यू हियर टुडे